true story. There was a former undersecretary of defense who was invited to speak at a large conference, like a thousand people. And in the middle of his remarks, he was holding a cup of coffee in a styrofoam cup and he and he looks down and he smiles and he interrupts himself. And he says, you know, last year I, s I was still the undersecretary and I spoke at this exact same cup. And last year they flew me here business class. There was someone waiting for me at the airport to drive me to the hotel. Someone had already checked me into the hotel and I just went back, you know, they took me up to my room. I came down in the morning, there was somebody waiting for me in the lobby and they brought me to the same venue. They took me through to the back entrance and they took me into a green room and they handed me a cup of coffee in a beautiful ceramic cup. He says, I'm no longer the undersecretary. I flew here coach. I took a taxi from the hotel to the from the airport to the hotel I took another taxi this morning to the venue I came in the front door found my way backstage and when I when I asked somebody do you have any coffee they pointed to the coffee machine in the corner and I poured myself a cup of coffee into this here styrofoam cup he says the lesson is the ceramic cup was never meant for me it was meant for the position I held I deserve a styrofoam cup and the great leaders all recognize that you can enjoy the ceramic cup you can enjoy the first class you can enjoy the nicer office absolutely enjoy it but they're not giving it to you they're giving it to the position you hold, either in the company or in the social hierarchy. We all deserve a styrofoam cup, and for the leaders that rem are remember that, you'll do just fine.